Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little bit different because I am going to be doing what I'm packing and packing essentials for traveling. So this is basically a pack with me. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to make this kind of vlog style a little bit for you guys, but I am going to grab my suitcase. Excuse the mess. <laughs> no, but you guys, if you guys know when I traveled recently, you know that this suitcase broke. So I'm not going to be using that this time because I am going to be taking an airplane. So I'll be using this ugly granny one, which is okay because it's smaller and nicer to like hold rather than that really big one. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to open this. Please do not judge my bag. I know it's ugly, but it's okay because my grandma gave it to me. <laughs> so first things first, you open the bad boy. Okay, so I'm going to be there for five days so i leave thursday so i'm gonna wear what i wear on thursday and then i'm gonna need an outfit for friday saturday sunday and monday for coming home so the hard part is figuring out what i'm going to actually wear while i'm there because i have no idea i don't know the weather actually i should probably check that okay fantastic so it's supposed to rain all week okay so i got my underwear packed and ready to go it's inside of that pocket there Another thing I'm going to be packing is my bathing suit. So this is the top, but um, these are the bottoms. So I'm going to put this in my pile. By the way, I'm going to show you guys how I pack my clothes right here into the suitcase. I don't always do this. I'm actually just trying to show you how I should be doing it all the time, but yes. <laughs> and I'm going to be quite honest with you. I don't think I'm going to be packing any makeup. <laughs> I'm actually just going to be packing eyebrow um, kit and then my mascara because... Yeah, I, in Florida, I cannot stand makeup. I literally just can't. <laughs> I need to re-pick up this video in probably two days from now because it is Monday and we leave Thursday. And uh, yeah, your girl's not even packed yet. <laughs> no, but I am going to pick this up on Thursday. I'm going to quickly pack this all away. And I'm not going to pack up my makeup and hygienic stuff until the night before. And then that is when you will see this. But I'm going to just quickly go ahead and show you guys how I pack my suitcase really quick. And then I will see you guys on Wednesday. I'm already tired okay so that's packed I don't know if you even saw this but I actually put a couple more bathing suits in here so I put these two one pieces I sorry about the string and then I actually put this in here because it'll probably be easier to carry around like money and my ID and stuff like that when I'm in the parks but yeah Welcome back, welcome back. <laughs> so it's a couple days later and we just got back from the mall. I didn't want to make this video an extremely long one. So I didn't vlog style picking out things. So I'm going to show you what I got. My face looks wet right now because I splashed water on my face. It is a hot day here in Grand Rapids. So I went to Dick's Sporting Goods really quick and I just grabbed like a carry-on. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually not going to use a suitcase just because it is so airy. Like everything I put in there, there's so much space still. And I think it would be a lot simpler if I just brought a carry-on. So I went and got this North Face carry-on from Dick's Sporting Goods. And I think it is so cute, especially with like the leather strap right here. And it also has like a, um, a crossbody strap as well. So you can just hold it like this, which is what I was kind of looking for. And I didn't want it too big just in case they didn't let me on with this carry-on. So one thing I got from Dick's Sporting Goods was this fanny pack. So it's just this pink Adidas uh, fanny pack and it has like the detail Adidas on the side of it. So I could either wear it up here, you know, and then, or I could wear it on my waist. 
And I actually got this one, and I'm not going to use this Calvin Klein one because that one's a little bit more thinner and a dressy wear type of a thing, so I'm not going to bring that with me, unfortunately. This one, I noticed it looks like it's waterproof because it has, like, the cloth, like, a different type of material. And also, it's padded, so if I get water on it accidentally or if I, you know, drop it or something like that, my stuff won't break or, you know get lost or anything on the inside which is really nice so this will be a really good thing to have with me so I think it is just so cute though it's pink <laughs> but we also went to Target really quick me and Giovanni grabbed two travel size pillows which is a necessity because um I don't know if you guys ever been or been on ever been on a plane before or even a car ride maybe you can just kind of uh, combine it I mean maybe you can kind of relate it to like being in a car so when you sleep you know I'm pretty sure a lot of you can relate to this when you sleep. Your head's like this, and then you wake up, and you have just this really big kink in your neck. So I am a sucker, and I actually got one of these. And this was only 10 bucks at uh, Target. There was, like, ones that were, like, $30. Giovanni wanted it. It was, like, a memory foam one, but I was like, boy. How often do we actually travel, though? Not too often. Um, I've actually been traveling a, lot, traveling a lot more this year, which is going to stop abruptly because I don't need to be traveling anymore and spending more money and missing work and stuff like that. So I need to keep my butt home, right Gio? Mm -hmm. <laughs> we actually grabbed two travel size things so you can um, put like your hygienic stuff inside of here. guys so everything is packed and ready to go now sorry I didn't show you guys putting it in a way in here but I put my fanny pack here this is what I'm gonna keep my like money and stuff like that inside so I'm gonna actually keep this in here not while I'm traveling yes and then this is everything I had just put my straight I mean my hairbrush in here and then all of my toiletries hopefully they allow that and then my straightener and that's it um, I also broke my thing. <laughs> I ripped off the tag accidently and all the beads came pli piling out so I had to duct tape it. I'm actually really sad about it because I just bought this and I didn't even get to use it yet. But hey, it works. This works. It's fine. The only problem I have is if they ask me to look inside of it or, you know, do extra searching on this just because I did have tape right here. Just they probably think I'm hiding something. But yeah, so that's it for packing. All right, so that's it for my packing with me video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed. Wish us a safe journey and we will see you guys in the vlogs. Bye guys. Darling, you.